Everybody's talking about inflammation today. Inflammation seems to be on everybody's mind. What is inflammation? Inflammation is a survival mechanism that the body puts forward in order to adapt and survive certain conditions. The story of inflammation is that many years ago we used to think of the chronic diseases of the modern world as separate entities. Heart disease, autoimmune problems, cancer, they were all problems that we looked at separately and named after the systems or organs that were affected. But through research we started realizing that before the chronic diseases of the modern world there is an underlying condition which is that the systemic inflammatory response is turned on. Inflammation is turned on all over the body. The situation today is that after we discovered that the chronic diseases of the modern world were preceded by inflammation, we started focusing on inflammation itself and started treating inflammation as a disease. But if inflammation is a perfect survival mechanism that the body is triggering in order to defend itself, the real question is, where is this inflammation beginning? Where is it being generated? And for most people today, this is at the level of what I call the Achilles heel of our body, which is our gut. Before the chronic diseases of the modern world comes inflammation. But before inflammation comes gut dysfunction. This is the main idea behind clean gut. And addressing the gut dysfunction, in my experience with my patients, resolves many of the problems that people consult me for. There are tons of anti-inflammatory strategies today. Anti-inflammatory nutrients like fish oils and omega-3 fatty acids, anti-inflammatory herbs, anti-inflammatory diet, anti-inflammatory heavy medications like prednisone and non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. But this is okay. But it's comparable to a faucet that's overflowing and you are just drying the floor with the water that overflowed. What I am talking about in Clean Gut is shutting the faucet itself. This is where inflammation is generated. The gut is where inflammation begins for most people today. Addressing gut dysfunction is going to the root of the problem. And this is what we need to do.